Hi everyone, welcome back to Design Basics. This is um, a piece of vanilla scratch cardstock that I'm using. I'm going to show you how to tie a knot with the ribbon that is double that is um, printed only on one side instead of being double sided printed, which is great because then you have the advantages of using using it with the solid side or with the pattern side. Okay, now I'm going to show you how to tie it with the pattern side visible, and then I'll go back and show you how to tie it with the other side. It's the same technique either way. And this is also the same technique that I use for tying my regular knot. So this is a knot with a print on one side. And I go with my left side up over my right, in front of my right, with the tails pointed up. Okay, then that left side goes behind. Give it a little tug hold it still with your finger. Now here what I would normally do is I would normally bring this down um, with the and it wouldn't matter what side was showing. So in this case I'm going to bring it down like I normally would and I'm going to hold it with my finger behind. Okay. Now here's the critical part. This part's not going to be seen but the tails are going to be seen. So once you have it at this point take this one and flip it the right one, but don't pull with it. Then take your left one and flip it, but that's the one you're going to normally pull with. So you can go ahead and snug it up. Once this piece comes up and over, then you can pull both of them. See, there you have a knot with both sides of the ribbon showing. Let me show you that one more time. Okay, I have my ribbon um, flat with the printed side down. Okay, left over right, just like that. Give it a tug, hold it with your finger, take this, the piece that's at the top, and we're going to pull it down with my finger behind it. The piece on the right hand side goes up and over, so it's left over right, then the right goes over the left inside. Put it through that hole. Here's the critical part turn your tails at this point, both of them. Then give the left a tug. And see, I can see, there we go. I was going to say this one was wanting to stick out, but it didn't. Because you can always go back in again and pull that loop up and over. But I still want my polka dots to show, so I need to give it a twist. Then, once this part is square and covering both, I can pull both sides. Got it? And again, your placement doesn't matter because you can always move it later. Okay, so there's how I do the knot with the dots showing. Untie this and I'll show it with the flat side. It's the exact same technique. It's just this time we'll start with our printed side up. So left over right and behind. Hold it with my finger. Pull down. Right over left and side. I don't want the polka dots showing, remember. So this time I'm going to give it a twist so the polka dots aren't showing. Give the other tail a twist. Pull with the left, but not with the right. Once this piece in the center comes up and over the knot, then you can pull with both of them. And there you have it with the plain side of the ribbon showing. Okay? That's the knot with a print on one side of your ribbon. Now, um, come back for the next video, and I'll show you how to tie a bow that the ribbon is printed only on one side. 